things in this bill. Tiny little good things. Like what? Like some of the words are okay. No, no. Yeah, they're spelled right. The, the spelling, for the most part, is very good in this bill. Uh, I saw President Kevorkian over there. Yeah. A lot of people have tried to say that, that you guys are crazy. The people are talking about death battles. They, they're trying to say that y'all are crazy and you have nothing to talk about. Let me tell you, when the government is in charge of saying what is covered and what is not covered in a bill, they have the power. So, yeah, sure, maybe this week, maybe this week or this month or this year, abortion services are not going to be covered in this bill. But next year, there's another Congress. And the year after that, there'll be another Congress. Amen. Technically, you change Congress every two years. But no, so every two years, there'll be a new Congress. And every two years, the government can say, you know what? Now abortion's covered. Now, end-of-life counseling is mandatory. They can change this thing at any time. What do you guys think about the old argument? What do you think about the argument? A lot of my Democrat friends are telling me, Hey, Tom, I do have Democrat friends. They're telling me, Hey, Tom, don't worry about it. We'll just pass this thing, and then we'll fix it. <laughs> just pass the bill. Pass the bill. Pass the bill. Pass the bill. There's, yeah, they're saying pass the bill. Is that how they felt about the Patriot Act? No. No. Is that what they thought about the TARP? Remember, everybody, including Mr. Bush, was telling us in October, we got to pass the TARP. we got to pass the TARP. Everybody on Wall Street tells me we got to pass the TARP. Bad idea. Bad idea. We need to think about legislation a lot more, especially when it's 1,000 pages! Amen! <laughs>